today we are going to the biggest Japanese culture convention in the UK. I really want to take home a talk in Chucky. Zurich Kado Collectibles here and mainly Japanese. There's Japanese slabs here. There's actually some really nice cards as well. Got PSA 10 um, CP6 Zard. I actually pulled that for someone once and it hit a 10. There's some really nice cards. The Firefighter Pikachu is one of my favourites as well. I actually picked that up in a collection once. So we're going to go for a Sylveon Unigaba. I opened two packs for this and I didn't pull this one, so I'm going for that. And I'm getting some the Chunkies. I feel like I really want one of these. It's like a deck box protector. I don't have a deck box, but. You don't have a deck? No. They can go on my backdrop. <laughs> I might come back for packs. Right, can I get these, please? Oh, it's traditional. It's Velcro. Oh, Remember's love it. Velcro. <gasps> oh, it's so soft. In you go, Sylveon. Do you want to take anything in the back? Yeah, maybe should we pop that in there, yeah? yeah? Okay. I've got butler number one and number two now. It's brilliant. <laughs> Did you see they got the Pikachu that we have <laughs> from Worlds, Harry? I feel like I want to buy everything because it's all like really trinkety and cute. They've actually got Pokemon cups. Oh wow, they've got Umbreon, Eevee. Okay, I feel like I'm going to spend loads of money today. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be dangerous. Ooh. Oh my goodness. We should get that for your brother. So my brother-in-law does a really good impression of him. Shalom, shalom. Real and I, I'm saying that, that's like something you put on your CV. That's me and Dean on a regular basis. <laughs> They've got Jack and Sally in their coffins. Is that a bit morbid? There's like a polytoad-ish. You say that looks like a polytoad? Well, you say, well, it's a frog. Are you joking? <laughs> that looks more like a polytoad. Oh, that may be <gasps> sick though. Oh, wow. Oh, he's got all the A. He's got Snorlax and Gengar as well. Maybe I should get one of each. So I get the butler a polytoad? I mean, it could pass as well. <gasps> oh, yeah. Depends what day of the week it is, but that's accurate. Oh, that's really cool. The Last Supper. The non-traditional Last Supper. How cool does that look? <gasps> what is that? Oh, it's a hook. It's a hook. You curl the tail up. Okay, we got Scarlet Powdea. Calyrex V box, what's even in here? Darkness Ablaze, Rebel Clash, and Chilling Rain. Not great. We've got Urshifu boxes. This was Battle Styles era, these two. Oh, there's loads here. Crown Zenith tins with the birds. Those Shiny and Fates boxes are pretty cool because the promos you get in that you can't get in the set. You can only get, obviously, by opening the packs. Magic the Gather. Oh, God, don't let the butler see that. Okay, <laughs> because he's on a bit of a weird hunt at the moment. It's us. Actually, loads of Pokemon everywhere. They've got Pokemon stickers as well. Found an outfit for the butler. <laughs> I dare you. Now, I believe in 2020, Mitsuhiro Rita actually was here doing a signing. I don't think anything like that happens at these kind of conventions now because they're so big. I've got this friend who's this really famous Minecraft YouTuber. Some of you might know him, Zetro. Don't know who that is, but there we go, I'll buy that for you. Minecraft Steve. Did it say on the back? No, it says Keychain. Is that Steve? Yeah. Why is he called Steve? Why not? Because it's his name. Right. Oh, look, I've learned something new today. Alex and Steve. Yeah. Zetro, you'll be proud of me. That is just absolutely fantastic. Oh, oh, it's him again. Dean actually got one last time, so I think Pokey Dean has got the Charizard one. I kind of want to buy one now. They're only £20 as well. Snorlax. Oh, I like the Eevee as well. How random. It's really cute though. I might get the Jigglypuff one. Or do I want the Sylveon? Oh, I don't know. Should I get them both? I'll be back. Doesn't take much, but I am, I am coming back. I am getting one. Yes, I am. Got a nice little bag collecting here. Right, 
Now it's time to go and buy some fun stuff. Also, some of the outfits here and the cosplay is amazing. Not as much as Comic-Con. I don't know how people have the energy. I literally got out of bed, washed my hair, clipped it up. Fish bash bosh. I might have just cost you money. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first Chansey I've seen as well. There's actually some really nice plushes here. I'll be back, Chansey. Oh my God, what's that? <gasps> Mr. Blobby. Do you not know what Mr. Blobby is? Oh, an educate. So Mr. Blobby <laughs> yeah. is like our childhood TV. The guy who played him's in prison. Honestly, you could come here with like a lorry and you wouldn't get everything home that you wanted to. Right, so here I can see they've got Japanese celebrations. They've got Attack on Titan. They've got Marvel, Star Wars, One Piece. Dragon Ball, and then there is Pokemon. So I'm seeing Japanese Pokemon Go, which was really fun to open, but I can also see V-Star Universe as well. <gasps> oh, I'm getting that. <laughs> oh my God, it doesn't take much. My first Blissey plush as well, I love yeah. it. Thank you so much. Honestly, I feel like I've made it now. <laughs> I've made it. The king himself. Honestly, the king himself. <laughs> <gasps> Good boy count number one. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Frank could never. It jingles so you'd never get lost. I need to give that to him so we don't lose him. take home a talking chucky like i really want to take home a talking chucky oh i know i have a problem but excuse me could i see the halloween 2 uh box please that one yeah <laughs> oh hello thank you so thank much you. cheers hey. yeah, huh? yeah just the mystery box you could open it here or somewhere else um we'll open it here so i think i might get there was someone who had a big mystery bag yeah. With the potential to have Pokemon. I haven't seen it yet. Um, yeah, so what do you want to do? do you want, should we grab some food and then we'll go and grab some more mystery boxes and maybe open them up and do some 151? We need to find the mystery bag. Yeah, we do. How long will it take him to notice? Three packs of one five one. Five minutes in. <laughs> Conviction. <laughs> oh, that's what I had to notice. Oh. You've got a figure. It's got pumpkin in it. <laughs> Cheers. What does that mean? <laughs> Okay, so we bought some mystery items. Now, don't know if they're all well. This has Japanese Pokemon packs in. This, we're not sure. It's got a Pokemon logo on it, so anything's possible. It literally feels like a box inside a bag, which has then probably got a few more boxes in it and all just with thin air, so we'll find out. And then, the last time I bought three 151 packs, we got really, really lucky. No, you, oh. <laughs> Oh my god! I think first off we're going to open this. Now, apparently there's god boxes of this, and the guy said the god boxes include 151. How many 151? Couldn't tell you. Is there some sweets in there? Wow. Since you've worked so hard today, have a oh, Malwam. You. You're welcome. We got some stickers. We got a top loader. I think the stickers have come out of the top loader right there. And then we have got some booster packs, two of them as well. Our V Star Universe. So actually, I'm pretty happy with that. We spent £20. You can see the prices on here. Obviously, these are priced up from the shop, but that on its own is £20 according to the people we bought it from. And then we got the two extras. So quite a lot. Let's start off here. And if the cameraman reacts well, I know I've hit something big. <laughs> and it's mainly Japanese Pokemon here. I haven't seen much English at all. Oh! V-Star Universe. Now, I'm going to master set Japanese 151. I think I want to master set V-Star, but it's going to be expensive. So let's see what we can get. I've got a whole box in my bag. Maybe we will open that. React when you see something good. Here we go. Right, pack number two. Are we ready? 
Come on. Ooh, not bad. We get the Arceus V-Star. Are we gonna get anything else in here? And there we go, the Radiant Eternatus. Okay, next up we've got a, a Nintendo Mystery Band. Apparently you get seven items for 20 pounds. Doesn't sound too bad. And it is, there's a box inside. There's a lot of packaging here. Save the planet, people. Oh, how am I gonna get into this? We're using the pin. There we go, perfect. <laughs> right, Pokemon Arceus. Little figure right there. This is sick. I actually want to put that on my backdrop. Oh, I saw some of these packs on their display. It's some sort of like tag, like sticker tag, I think. I can see that Mimikyu's an option, Charizard, Eevee, Pikachu, Piplup, a uh, few others on there. Gotcha. Okay, that could be cool. So we'll open that. There's the Kirby pack there. I don't know what's in there, but that feels quite thick, actually. Temporary tattoo? This is more than seven items. Oh, we got some Fusion Strike fun packs. Let's open this, because I want to I wanna see what's in here. It's so small. What is that? It's like a little keychain accessory. <laughs> 151 time. You seem very keen for me to open up 151. I'd like to get Giovanni. I pulled that for someone out of the very first box I opened. So now it's time for me. Right, here we go. Nope, nope. It's really not looking good. Nope. Oh. These are the ones that have like a few Pokemon in them. <gasps> There's a Crystal Mimikyu. Oh my God. Oh, I really like the Crystal one. <laughs> I don't know which one to choose. I... Do I need it? That's the question. I don't need it. Then look at it. Look at that. If that's not happiness, I don't know what is. It is £175, though. I've made the decision, executive decision made. Would I be able to get one of these? Yeah, it's these? Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. Got it. Where's it going? I don't know, but I've got it. <laughs> picked up a 30 pound snack bag so we're going to do a bit of a um well the butler just wants me to do a food challenge and eat stuff that i don't like it's like a little backpack i can wear it as a backpack i feel like i'm in school again okay so there is a lucky dip bin here and it's one pound for one pick or five pound for seven. So you put your hand in, you can actually win pretty big. So might as well give it a go, have a bit of fun. We'll, we'll all be like carrying terraniums home with us. Oh my God, there's loads in here. Ooh! 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 Oh! Oh my God! Ooh, postcard print. Did you see that? Put that in your Mario Pikachu shell. There we go. Oh no, it's going to be another five hours later. Harry, pop that in your bag. Oh, they're really sour. It's not nice, is it? It's really Disgusting. Nice. Right, 30 pound snack mystery bag. There's a lot of food in here, that's all I'm gonna say. Here we go. Soft. I'm gonna go do it in categories. <gasps> Brow buns. No, they're like crackers. They look like crackers of some sort. Oh my God, there's something fish shaped in here. Build your own jelly. Bun with chocolate in it. There is a lit, do you know how much food is in this bag? It's like Mary Poppins. They look sour. Right, this I am not drinking. Lady Boba in a can. Oh, okay. Matcha latte bubble tea. That could be a butler one, that one. We'll put that there. Fish. Ooh. These look like going peach on that one. Strawberry chocolate, that looks quite cute. Oh, they look, oh yeah, I like the look of them. 
are they? They're like mini like chew sweets. There's like coffee, chocolate. Oh, there's like a mini version of these strawberry ones as well. So yeah, we'll pop that there. Right, so I'm gonna start off with this because I've got no idea what it is. Oh, there's, there's like multiple in here. <laughs> oh my, it smells really chocolatey. It's like chocolate, it's like cocoa. It's like eating hot chocolate powder all mushed together. Not bad. Next up, I've got a coffee bean. It's literally coffee. That is disgusting. Oh, please, let me cleanse my palate. Thank you. I feel like I'm really, really not going to enjoy these. Oh, it feels like a jellyfish. Oh, no. I don't want to do this. No. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it took a long time to get feedback out of that one. It's like congealed mush. I'm going to give that a miss. Now that's out of the way, I'm going to do a giveaway for you guys. I'm going to open a V-Star Universe box and it's going to be me versus you. One box, I get half the packs and one lucky person watching this channel gets half the packs. You do, however, have to do something. You have to. Be subscribed, you have to like this video and you have to leave a comment down below. So, without further ado, let's do it. Opening up the V-Star box. This is a box I actually bought today from Brotherhood Games whilst at the convention. So I'm gonna pull all the packs out and I'm gonna split it with you guys. So one for you, one for me, two, three, four, Five. So, one of you guys is getting these five packs right here. Let's hand that Yoink. to you. Now, I don't have a V-Star Universe, well, who? <laughs> I don't have a V-Star Universe, a master set, but I'm getting tempted now to put one together. I'm one of master set Japanese 151, so let's do it. Now, the last time I opened up a V-Star box, I pulled two SARs. too crazy. If I don't get anything crazy, that means you guys are getting the goods. There's a, there's a feast happening. There is an absolute feast. <laughs> Look at him go. He's an animal. Get something good for me at least. I'll be happy with one nice hit. Drum roll. He's the Keldeo AR. That's a really, really nice card. I think there's something behind there as well. <gasps> oh, there we go. S-A-R. But don't worry guys, there will be other good hits in the box. We know what V-Star Universe is like. Got a cute ditto right there. Okay. Ooh, Charizard V, we will take that. Very, very nice. Oh, we got the Radiant Horlucha as well. Two more packs to go. And massive shout out to Brotherhood Games for the box as well. Always supplying the good. What else are we getting here? Oh, we get the Diancy AR. Very, very nice. Love that one. Followed by the Oranguru V. We will take that. Deoxys follow as well. Okay, last pack magic. Oh, we get the Mew V Max. I will take that. And the Moltres follow. Gengar. There we go, guys. So, guys, remember you have to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below for your chance to win five V-Star Universe packs. I hope you enjoyed the day at Hyper Japan, and I'll see you again next time.